Oh, blimey. Yeah, there's the... Uh... What's that? Hold my bondage set. That's disgusting. Why is that here? Take a walk on the dark side. Blimey. Why is... That's quite weird, isn't it? Getting cheeky with it. Oh well, they literally breeze blocked it up, but not much point now. Speak for a car. What's that? Oh, f Alright, Scarlett, how did you find this place? Um, Google. <laughs> oh, okay, so it's basically a long since derelict army barracks, right? Yeah, I mean, training grounds. Training grounds. I mean, long, long time, isn't it? Been yeah, abandoned. Oh, right, okay, explains it. It's properly trashed. During the 1950s, the camp was used to train national servicemen before they were posted to Germany in Malia. In 1961 to 1964, saw the Royal Green Jackets move in, whilst their barracks in Winchester was refurbished. After this, it was little history. It appears the site may have been used by composite signals organisations. Okay, like uh, barracks. Yeah. You stay in your billets, These don't you? Staff were based at the listening station at. Oh, okay. The rumours that they start used to listen to Russian spy trawlers in the North Sea during the Cold War from the flowers down, uh, but don't know if this is actually confirmed. Cool. Well, should we go in? It's like worms. That's cool. Fresh. That smells uh, brand new. Yeah. Yeah, it's wet. Don't touch it. I'm not gonna touch it. What the hell is that? Oh my god, it's a seven days to die bike. Look at that. This is it's pretty cool. Do you think do you think that's what she meant by caged bit? And there. Uh, That's really cool. Again, that's literally, uh, still looks quite wet. Wow. Go on. Despite there being fresh paint. No spray cans? No spray cans, they've actually taken it 
taking it all the way, I've cleared up after myself. And it's literally, literally brand new. Interesting, like, no one's touched the ceiling. I guess it's probably quite hard to. Oh, oh here's the cage. Do you know what? I have a, I have a theory. If this is ex-military, this will be a Faraday cage. So basically, this stops signals from getting in or out. Okay. That's what I think it probably is. So I don't know about the floor, but if it's conductive, com completely conductive, actually solid concrete is probably okay. Then, uh, then yeah, it's a Faraday cage. Yeah, but then if it was, if it was literally for, like, uh, secret um, communications, then uh, there won't be. And I mean, that's double, a double thick wall. All fresh, and yeah, like you say, no, no graffiti cans, no fresh trash. It's literally. Yeah, I don't think it's from the. I don't think it's from the guys either. Got him? Yeah. Yeah, it does actually. Oh, then So interesting point. A water tank. What well, this is? Uh, that is up there. Oh. Urbex camel. See, every, all fresh dates as well. Mm. <laughs> awesome. Oh, this is cool. It's a gym rack. Ah, oh, someone's painted them green. Mm -hmm. It's the same guy as before. I like Deadpool type person. Oh no, Nazis have been here. That we were just in an armory. Oh, okay. Cut us apart. That makes sense. And then you put munitions in the cage, maybe then, and. Bricks are bleeding. So. 
whatever needed a solid platform with a tiny window and a big door. Oh. Ugh. 